There are no international grains market is the biggest in West Africa, supplying food stuff to customers in Nigeria, Niger, Chad, Cameroon, and the Central Africa, among other countries. Speaking at a media briefing, the president of the Wano Market Development Association, Mutaka Isa, said the traders transacting business in the market are not hoarding food stuff with a view of creating artificial scarcity. The management of the Wano International Grants Market in Kano State has dispelled the speculations that dealers transacting business in the market are holding food stuff in order to create artificial scarcity. The management has dismissed perception that the traders are increasing price of food items arbitrarily to cause excruciating hardship to populace. The various grains and other food stock you see in these warehouses are only on transit. They must be stored past before they are sold to our customers. Storing the goods in the warehouses is essential so as to prevent them from being spoiled and also to for convenience purposes. I want to inform the general public that government and organization purchase these grants from us. For example, the federal government of Nigeria buy grants from us. Organizations such as World, World Food Programs, WIP, also buy grants from us and distribute to IDP camps in Nigeria and elsewhere. I wonder how these extreme consumers can buy from us if, are hold, if we are holding these grants. So I'm appealing to general public, particularly our business partners, to disregard the weak rumor as it is baseless and unfounded. It could be recalled that the traders of the market were at the office of Kano State Public Complaints and Anti-Corruption Commission disassociating themselves from the alleged ill practice and pledged to sustain the current price of food stuff. Muhammad Adamu, AIT News Kano. AIT.live, on air, online, online.